guys and today I'm back with another video and I'm redoing a Primark haul in today's video as you can tell by the title. I am so so excited to be filming the video because I've got quite a few things that I'm really excited to show you guys. I've got quite a few similar items because there were a few things that um, I liked and I got multiples of just in different colours because I just loved the feel of them and the quality of them so yeah. This is also from two different trips. I went like a few weeks ago and I also went today and you know what? I've got some really, really good things and I've definitely spent like, I'm going to say under £120 on all of these items so that is literally incredible because I got so much and I usually get like four things for 120 probably less than that because shoes are like 70 Anyway, I'm going to start rambling and just get on into the video. It means so much for you to give it a thumbs up if you enjoy and maybe subscribe. I'm so close to 150,000. So, so close. So close. It's like so close. I just, I can't get there. So if you could subscribe, that would mean so much. And yeah, let's get started. I'm going to start with the two kind of different things. Well, three different things actually. And the first one is this. And it is like a little pug. It looks like, like a bulldog kind of. Like... The stance reminds me of a bulldog. Anyway, it's a little black pug and it's got like a little gold crown on its head. I absolutely love it. I think it's so cute. And I'm going to get some shelves put up in my um, living room. And this looks so cute just on one of the shelves because I needed a few little decorative pieces. Because I literally have none to put on those shelves when they go up. I thought this would be really cute and it was only £4. So I just grabbed it. Don't you think it's adorable? I think it's pretty damn cute. I also got this. I absolutely love this. It reminds me of Amanda Steele. If you know who she is, she's like Makeup by Mandy 24. This reminded me of her so much. I don't know why. I got it and I bought it home. I was like, this reminds me of someone. It reminds me of Amanda Steele. I think it might be the blue. I think she might have had her hair this colour at some point. Not too sure. <laughs> but I have my keys attached to that. Honestly, the only reason I got this is because every time I was looking for my keys, it would take me half an hour. And now if you put your hand in your bag and you feel a big fluffy circle thing, you're going to know it's your keys. Like, you're not going to be carrying a cat around with you, are you? The last little thing I got that isn't clothing is this bag. I needed a new bag for college because I need to take my laptop to college. I need to take my camera to college. And this is a really good size for that. As you can see, there are two little clips there. You can clip it together so it's smaller on the side or you can extend it so it's a bigger bag, which is so handy for me. So if I want to use it throughout the day, I can use it. If I want to take it to college, I can use it. Carry-on bag, actually. This would be a good carry-on bag, apart from the metal. But you don't really get bag style metal, so yeah, I got that. Oh, and also, I think this was one pound fifty. Now onto the clothing items. So let's start with this jumper that I got a billion different colours of. So I got the same jumper four times because I don't I don't have an answer as to why, but I did. So, so the first shade of this jumper I got is this really pretty dusky pink. And when you're looking at it, you're probably like Beth, you're not that big. I know, it's so stretchy and so like, whoop, and it's really long so you can tuck it into your jeans and it's like a bodysuit without like the uncomfortable poppers, like don't get me wrong, I love bodysuits, you'll see some bodysuits in this haul, but they're really uncomfortable and just like if you wear underwear with them then you have like double underwear lines, it's just like, uh, I, I think I just prefer long tops, honestly, I mean bodysuits are good but I'm lazy. I can't have full turtlenecks because my face is a little bit chubby. You probably can't tell right now because I've got a shirt on, but if I got something coming up to like here, like I just look like a floating chubby round head. I love this and it was £6 and I got it in a size 8. Next I got that same jumper in black. Again, it oh this one was £8, getting a little bit pricier here. I think these might be slightly different because the, the neck looks a little bit frilly. I don't know if you can see, let's put it against the wall. A little bit frilly. It's got ribbing again and it's really tight. And the sleeves are actually shorter on this one as well. So it is a little bit different. And I got this in a size eight again. Then I got the same jumper in green. I love this shade of green. This was eight pounds as well. It's got the ribbing, the kind of frilly neck. You can't see the color too well because of the lighting, but this is a try and haul so you'll be able to see on the try on part, hopefully. And lastly for that jumper, I got it in like this golden yellowy shade, which I really, really like. This was £8 again, I think, 
I just love this. It's so, so nice. And I love this shade. It's just like autumn, isn't it? And if you could like sum autumn up in a colour, it would be this one. And it's a little bit sparkly as well. Like, not noticeably sparkly, but if you got really close to me, you'd see the sparkles. Also, what is this light doing? But yeah, I love this. It's really pretty. Now, this jumper. Let's go with this jumper. I also got this one. This is different, but where's the tag? I haven't worn it yet. This is... £10, I got it in a size 8, and it's like a mint, minty green kind of, light blue, it's got a scalloped hem, which I really really like, is it still called a hem when it's a top? Someone let me know in the comments. It's got like that scalloped end with like those sleeves that go tighter around your wrist, which I love, I like that it goes tight so you can like scrunch your sleeves up, and I love this, I love like... I don't know, I think it's really pretty. It looks like someone kind of stabbed it in the middle, but I'm sure that'll fix once it's been washed or worn. Next, I got this. I thought it was a dress when I got it, and I was a tad disappointed when I realised it wasn't. But it's okay, I can wear it with leggings when I'm just not in the mood for life. Or a really, like, cosy travel outfit, because a lot of you guys know I'm going to New York soon, so I need an aeroplane outfit that's a little bit warmer. So I got this. This is, like, a long burgundy kind of turtleneck kind of not jumper it's got this like hem down the front which is pretty cool it's got tight sleeve it's kind of a little bit of a bat wing not noticeably a bat wing but just a, it's just a little a little sun sun and I think this was about six pounds it's really good quality I've worn it so many times it's still really soft and just it hasn't gone out of shape or lost the softness or the color and I love it. I used to really, really hate Primark. Like, I used to have a thing about, like, not shopping in Primark. And I think that's because I kind of went through a phase of being, like, a little bit, like, I'm too good for Primark. But, you know, I'm not. It's Primark. And I, I do like inexpensive, pretty good quality things. I've got to be honest. So I've got a few things left. Not too many. Let's go through the bodysuits first. So, first bodysuit I got is this one. It's just a stripey little, like cami type thing. I'm not the biggest fan of this to be honest. I think I'm going to end up wearing it backwards. I much prefer it with the lower neck instead of the higher neck. It's just stripey, it's a bodysuit, really simple. Not the biggest fan like I said but I think it was like £4 so you know what. I'd spend £4 on a rock so. The next bodysuit I got I think I'm going to give to my little sister because I think this will suit her a lot more than me because she's got a slimmer face. She looks like her face shape is a lot more like my mum's, um, I was about to say my face shape's a lot more like my dad's, but I don't know my dad, <laughs> hashtag abandoned at birth, lol, I shouldn't really make jokes about that, <laughs> sorry, um, but yeah, I got this stripey turtleneck, half turtleneck bodysuit, it's got long sleeves, and it honestly does look great, but the chubby face thing, this is a bit too high of a turtleneck, for me you know that chubby face thing but I think that'll look really good on my sister and she is nine but she's very very tall for nine so I think they should fit perfectly this bodysuit that I got I absolutely love I've worn it so many times it is literally the simplest thing ever it's a grey bodysuit it looks like a leotard and it's just like off the shoulder not really off the shoulder just kind of like boat neck I guess I love it I think it's really cute big fan and I think it was like £4. I think all the bodysuits were £4. I'm not too sure. I got them quite a while ago. So this is like... This isn't going to be able to be worn for much longer. But it's an off-the-shoulder, stretchy... It reminds me of Stranger Things. I'm pretty sure that was set in the 80s. This was £6 and I got it in a 6 because it does look like it runs a little bit big. Like That looks big for a 6, don't you think? I just love the colours of this. I absolutely love um, navy with like that, uh, oh my god, I can't think, a mustard and white. I think it's, I think it's pretty damn rude. Now I've got two things left and they're both skirts. So the first one I got is, I think it's a bodycon skirt or maybe it's an A-line skirt. Can't tell, oh that's the back. Can't tell just yet, but I got it in an eight and it was four pounds. Four pounds. If this was on ASOS, it'd be like 15 for no reason. 
I love it. I think it's really pretty. I love this kind of like hand tooth thing going on. I think it's really pretty. I think with my off the shoulder jumper and like boots, this could look really, really cute. Got another skirt that's pretty damn similar. And it's this one. It's definitely A-line. And I think I should have got a six in it. I was going to. Maybe it'll fit me. It looks a little bit big. I guess I could just tuck something into it. But it's literally just a checked black and white skirt with like fake pockets. Are they fake pockets? They're real pockets. They're actually real pockets. I've never ever had a skirt with real pockets. That's so exciting. And this was in a size... Wait, I just told you. This is in a size 8 and it also costs £8. I love it. I really love it. It looks a little bit long on camera, but it's high-waisted. So don't worry, I'm not going to be looking like your nan. But yeah, that is pretty much everything I have to show you guys. If you guys have gone shopping recently and you have any, like, awesome things, please tell me in the comments, like, what they are and where you got them from because... I'm trying to save money, but I'm no good at it, so I might as well enjoy the money that I earn. I should probably pay rent, to be honest, instead of buying clothes, but who likes paying rent? Not me. But anyway, I love you guys so much. Thank you so much for watching, and yeah, please don't forget to give this video a thumbs up, subscribe, comment, all that stuff. If you want to check out my social media, it's all listed in the description if you want to know more about me. I don't know why you would, but maybe you do. <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I will see you on Saturday with a new video. I think it's going to be a night routine, so you know, it's just what I'm hearing on the street. <laughs> see you next week. Bye!